Shashidar Shetty, registrar from, again, a very senior district judge from Karnataka. Mr. Ladekar, who is really the driving force. He's an ex-armed forces officer who is working in the judiciary, served the nation as an armed service officer and then joined the judiciary. And we have uh, Sujata Singh, who is from the state of Uttarakhand, senior judicial officer. And we have Satish Arora from the Delhi Higher Judicial Service. Colonel Marwa, again, Colonel, as you know, defines where he comes from. Mr. Soni, then a young officer from the Center for Research of and Planning, Amarendra Kuntal Pathak from the state of Orissa, Parvinder Singh Arora from the state of Himachal Pradesh, Ashish Shiradhunkar, the scientist from NIC who is the backbone of the eCourse project, and Ms. Arunori from the state of Tamil Nadu who leads the and finally, last but not the least, I very fondly refer to him as Tarzan because of he's all over the place even at 12 midnight, Mahesh Patankar, who looks after every little corner of our building and construction project. So this has really been a multi-stakeholder cooperation. It couldn't have been possible with, without the tremendous support which I received from the entire team of registrars and officials in the Supreme Court, many of whom are not here really. Mr. Rakesh Sharma is probably overseeing the arrangement. There he is, Mr. Rakesh Sharma is there. Usually he's always behind the scenes coordinating something or the other. Now, the reason why I thought I should mention all this is that I genuinely feel that the Supreme Court may be like located in Delhi, but it is not the Supreme Court of Delhi. It's the Supreme Court of India. And since I took over the office of the Chief Justice of India, we've made an effort to bring officers from all over the country into the registry of the Supreme Court. And they bring a great amount of diversity, inclusion.